you think you have a limit. As soon you touch this limit, something happens and you suddenly can go a little bit further. With your mind power, your determination, your instinct, and the experience as well, you can fly very high. Prepare to qualify. thing is to make sure you learn through your mistakes. Hi, I'm Chris. I'm from Perth, Western Australia, and I've just built my very own racing simulator and I want to share with you guys, so here it is. Well, I don't know, about 10 years ago, I saw a Facebook video, I think it was Motion Dynamics, and it was had hydraulic actuators, I'm pretty sure they're hydraulic, I'm not sure, but it blew my mind, and I went, wow, this is what I want to do, and this is what I want in life, and, and at the time, I think the price was about 50,000 US dollars, so uh, yeah, I kind of just, yeah, <laughs> got turned off by that, but, it's stuck in the back of my mind forever. I, I love cars, I love computer games, I love computers, I love technology, I love tinkering, I love all that stuff. So I'm like, you know, I set myself a goal 10 years ago. Even though the DIY sort of scene wasn't there yet at the time, I, um, I, I, yeah, I, I kept a close eye on it. And um, yeah, eventually the DIY scene caught up and I logged on to X Simulator one day, just randomly at work. and. Yeah, someone had, a couple of guys had six DOF hexapods rock, rock, rocking, you know, all the latest games, and I and I was just like, holy crap! Where, you know, I sort of had a break from looking for this stuff for a couple of years, and I was kind of kicking myself because I now I'm on the back foot, and I wanted to be on the front foot with these guys, you know. Um, so yeah, I started researching and researching and researching and reading in forums and pages and <laughs> yeah and eventually I thought you know this is, this is very possible and, and it, that's it that just kicked me in to second gear and started ordering stuff yeah probably way too soon I probably didn't do enough research and you know R&D costs a bit of money because you, yeah you sort of get carried away and you buy everything and then you realize that I don't need half of that and then you, you change your plans and yeah oh that's the cost of R&D, I guess, but yeah. And here we are. <laughs> okay, sixth off is six degrees of freedom. So there's a, your different types of movements. So you need this to feel like traction loss in a car, you know, you want your yaw and all this. So you have pitch, you have your roll, you have your sway, and you have your surge, and then you have your heave, which is only really achievable. Like you can, you can, people are doing it now with like a, a four doff, and then they add like another bass, so they can get the traction loss and the surge and stuff, which is working quite well too, so, but, I don't know, I, I like the look of the hexapods, I like the look of the, they just look angry and they look mean and, and I think, yeah, it's just a different feeling. You can get the center of gravity right at your waist, you know, you sort of, 
where you would be in a car, I don't know, it's just, and you can get that roll right where you need it. You, six dots, you can have the platform um, up higher for like a, good for flight simulators, you know, because they want to tilt like a plane, you know, it's very, it's fine, but I think in a, in a car situation when the tilting axis is below your feet, it doesn't quite give you that feeling that you're in a car, so having like a sunken platform where you got the center of gravity right where you want it pretty much halfway up your chair sort of thing, you know? Um, yeah, like it's just a whole different sort of immersion, yeah. Yeah, but they look cool, so that was pretty one of the main reasons, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so people probably help me get here right now and I'd probably like to thank would be uh, the whole X simulator community that it's just it's just amazing the amount of information people are willing to share and and it's quite easily something that someone would build and be so proud of that they would not want to share it with anyone else and just show it off but the whole community is just blown my mind and everyone wants to share everything and and I'm, I'm so into that whole like sharing is caring you know uh, we can learn from each other's mistakes and you, you've got like Thanos working full-time job but also on the side he's designed a controller like you know for the community or for whatever reason but like it's 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 come a long way since he first started and, and you know and you got to give these guys respect you've got fly pt mover or um, petro he started off just like me building a simulator and then all of a sudden went oh you know there's a few things i'd probably do better than sim tools or something and then started off making just a plugin for it and then all of a sudden next thing you know he's full blown making his own program that does exactly the same thing but oh it's just it's just it's mind blowing and, he, and you know these guys they don't expect anything in return they're not about just a cash grab he, they've all got their own jobs we've all got our own jobs to go to and and it's just a hobby for all of us and everyone just um gets amongst it yeah so <laughs> um if you if you enjoy this content, I don't know, this is just a trial. We had a few beers this afternoon, thought we'd try to whip up a little video and see how it goes. Um, if you're into this kind of thing, want to see more about the process, how it all works, I don't know, let us know. We can, we can upload some stuff. Um, I know there's plenty of stuff out there, but I just feel in the sixth off hexapod sort of community, um, there's only really one or two sort of guys out there and um, I'm by no means any pro, I'm still learning, we're all still learning, it's so much to learn, it's a constant, it's just constant, you want to upgrade things, you want to do this, you want to do that better, and it's it's never ending, and I don't think there is going to be an end to it, and I think, um, yeah, I'm keen to share everything with you guys, and yeah, like and subscribe if you like it, yeah, <laughs> that's <laughs> <laughs>